Let us draw and paint. Pencil tool. The pencil tool is used to draw thin, free form lines or curves. Let's do it. To use the pencil tool, click on the home tab. Click the pencil tool in the tools group. Click the size button and then click a line size. Drag the pointer to draw. The line will be drawn. Quick quiz. What is the central place where all commands are located is called? Brush tool. The brush tool is used to draw lines that have a different appearance and texture. By using different brushes, you can have different effects. Let's do it. To use the brush tool, click on the home tab. Click on the brush arrowhead button, select a brush type. Click on the size arrowhead button and select the thickness. Select the color. Drag the pointer to draw. The shape with brush will be drawn. Quick quiz. What difference do you find in the pencil tool and brush tool? Eraser tool. Use the eraser tool to erase the unwanted areas of your picture. Let's do it. To use the eraser tool, click on the home tab, click the eraser button in the tools group, click the size arrowhead button, drag the eraser over the area of the picture that you want to erase. The unwanted part of the image will get erased. Fill with color tool. The fill with color tool is used to fill the entire picture or some closed shape area with color. Let's do it. To use the fill with color tool, click on the home tab, click on the fill with color button, click on the color 1 and select the color to fill. Click inside the area in which you want to fill the color. The color will get filled inside the shape. Text tool. Using the text tool, you can also enter your own text or message in your picture. Let's do it. To use the text tool, click on the home tab. Click on the text tool in the tools group. Drag the pointer to the drawing area where you want to add text. Under text tools on the text tab, click the font face, size, and style in the font group. The text will get typed.